We begin with breaking news this morning. Fire officials in Seneca are investigating an early morning fire. Let's check in now with 7 News' is Henry Coburn. He's been speaking to crews about the situation and is joining us live now. Good morning, Henry. Good morning, Sabila. Fire officials say that a camper burned to the ground overnight at an address off Hoyt Street in Seneca. This is actually the camper over here or what remains of it. Now, of course, fire officials were successful in putting out the blaze, but they say that there are several unanswered questions still. According to Seneca Fire Department Chief Richie Cottle, neighbors initially told crews there were likely two people in the camper when it was on fire. The firefighters battled the blaze and say that they could not find anyone inside. Firefighters say there's no evidence anyone was injured. After the fire was out, crews searched nearby to see if they could find the person or people neighbors believed were inside. They say they couldn't find anyone. Now, a man who says he's the property owner says drugs have been a problem in this area in the past. The chief tells me that they're going to continue investigating what exactly led up to the fire. He told me earlier this morning that it was possibly a space heater or something of that sort, but an investigation is going to continue later today now that the sun is up and we'll uh, bring you more answers as we learn them on air and online at WSPA.com. For now, we're live in Seneca. Henry Coburn, 7 News.